Alright guys, here we are on to video number two um, from today. This is the Out of Office Target Beauty March Spring Break was supposed to be the theme for this one. So let me open it up with my trusty old knife. Or not, because you know, I'm one-handing this. That's okay. Still get it open. So again, if you guys don't like this video because, you know, my usual video, I, I have all types of videos. It's my channel. I kind of do them how I like. So if you followed me for my coronavirus videos, you don't have to watch these. Don't feel bad for not watching them. Just don't give them a thumbs down. All right. Out of office. Which I guess a lot of people are out of office right now. They're working from home. But those of us in healthcare do not have the uh, ability for that. Those of us who are in the supply chains, coming from overseas, down at ports and such, we, well, not we, because that's not my job, um, but they are also essential. People who are working in places like grocery stores, we're all on the front line. So let's hope for the best. And my son's in the background, if you can hear him calling for me. Yes, Michael. Yes, in one second. Okay, I will in one second. He wants me to turn on the TV so we can play a game. I've been playing video games all day. My eyes are tired, actually. And again, beautiful little wrapping paper that, you know, we're not going to be wasteful in these times now, are we? Yes, I love Mario Kart. I love Mario Kart, everybody. All right, so this is, mm, this box actually smells very, very good. It's very uplifting. Cetaphil Daily Cleanser. It is for normal to oily skin. Glitter, glycerin is one of the main ingredients. Glycerin is very good for your skin. It is made in Canada. Sorry guys again about the shaky hands. Like I said, I've been feeling kind of under the weather and I think my fever might be coming back again. It's been a low grade fever since Monday. And here we are, Saturday. <laughs> anyway, so this is Thiers. Thiers. I use their astringent on my face. So it's a facial mist with witch hazel, rose petal. I don't know if I'm going to like that scent, but it has rose petal in it. So we'll see. But I do like some of the products this company makes. It's not very drying to the skin at all. Yes, Mikey. Can you turn on the TV? Yes. In one second, as soon as I'm done making this video. Mommy's making a video. Okay. Then this is the Extra Strength Refresh and Restore Coconut Miracle Oil Dry Shampoo with the essence of vanilla bean and coconut oil. So, me actually, I want to smell this one. No, don't tell me the lid came broken. Ah, my luck. Maybe I could just pop it right back on and let's see. Ooh, whoa. I don't know. I can't really smell the vanilla on this very much, but you know, dry shampoo. Can I smell? I'm all for that. Sure. My son wants to smell it. Can you smell it? It's... What does it smell like to you? Mm. I smell the coconut oil slightly. I don't smell the vanilla, but I'm definitely going to give this one a try because maybe it won't dry out my hair. I have really dry hair and it's very curly. The next one is the Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Refreshing Dry Shampoo. I guess... Candy. Candy? It smells like candy? Okay. My son figured out, he says, this one smells like candy. All right. So this is Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Dry Shampoo Refreshing. I mean, I like these, especially with curly hair because I use a lot of product. It sometimes can weigh down my roots, so then my roots look all floppy, I guess you would say, and then the rest of my hair is curly. But as of right now, <coughs> sorry, as of right now, I've been actually wearing my hair up. Since this whole coronavirus crap going on, I don't want to get, so my hair has been, uh, if you've seen my last few videos, my hair has been um, bunned up. Here you go, mommy. Thank you. So this is the Nexus Humectris Conditioner Protein Infusion and the Nexus. Therapy, therapy. I don't know how they want us to pronounce that. Ultimate Moisture Shampoo. This one smells like green candy. And apparently this one smells like green candy. 
So yeah, these are going to be really nice to try. I always like these little sample size one. And I'm definitely going to try this, but back to my hair. Um, I've been wearing it bunned up since the whole coronavirus. I don't want to get my hair very, you know, I don't want to expose it to germs because I don't wash my hair every single day because of my texture. I can't wash my hair every day or otherwise, like, I won't be able to brush it. So I have been um, wearing it in a bun. So, like, every three days I wash my hair. It just gets right bunned up. I put my oils in it and it gets bunned up. But still, these would probably be cool in between Look. to make sure I don't get any, like, you know, hair buildup or anything. And the next one is Smith, Smith's Rose and Black Pepper Natural Deodorant, which I do use natural deodorants now. I think I've tried a little jar. They used to have it, like, where you stick your fingers in like that and then, like, smear it on your pits. I tried that before and it gave me a really bad rash, but it was lavender scent. And as much as I love lavender and air fresheners, I do not like lavender in my deodorants because they burn me. So let's, I'm going to smell this one now. And that's actually a full size. So my son wants to smell it first. He just... Cotton candy and candy. It smells like cotton candy and candy, guys, according to my son. I'm definitely going to give it a try. I can have a, a hint of the black pepper, and yet it smells like rose also. But it's, I don't know. It doesn't smell like a too much of an overpowering it, rose it scent. It smells like grass, too. Yeah, I actually agree with my son. It smells like grass to me. So I'll give it a try. I don't know if I want my pits to smell like grass, but I think it's kind of cool. This is a full size, which I think <clears throat> these run about $8 anyway. So I think that's kind of cool that I've got this itself makes this whole box worth the $7. Both boxes that I did get are worth $7, or that's the cost. So I'll put them all back. Yeah. But definitely both of these boxes are really cool. I also get a boxy charm, which I'm considering canceling my boxy charm soon because just with all the stuff going on in the world right now, I feel like I could be spending $25 differently. And if I ever feel the need that I just want like a little pick me up with some girly stuff, you know, body wash and shampoos, whatever, I can always pick up one of these Target things for seven bucks. Mom. I mean, look at this. All these cool things I get to try for seven dollars. And you know, what I don't like, I always pass on to people. So I think it's definitely worth it. Definitely. So guys, this is the little card that comes with it. So I got six things in this. Oh, I'm sorry, seven. So I definitely think the dry shampoos, because they last very long, are great value. Even this facial mist. I'm probably going to try it like in a second. Definitely worth it. These are a little, you know, small, but they're great for travel. You know, if we're ever allowed to travel anywhere anytime soon, hopefully by summertime, we can travel. And even these are great for like travel. <laughs> Traveling. Okay. Anyway. So I really find both of these boxes to be great and to be fun. So that was the March out of office, yeah. supposed to be spring break box. All right, guys, I hope you like this video too. Make sure you like and subscribe. And excuse my hands, like I said, they look horrible because I haven't been painting my nails because it's zero point because I washed my hands so much using alcohol, pure alcohol, even on my hands because of my job. And um, my joints are just very swollen, as is. My skin is, like, super dry and neat. So they look horrible. And the joints are swollen because it's the fun of the autoimmune disease. So, guys, I hope you really like these boxes. I hope this gives you a little sense of normalcy. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's hope I just have allergies. Um, my cat, as usual, he likes the photobomb. This is Orion. And he likes to play his toys. Mm -hmm. And he likes to play with toys. He just likes to photobomb. So. He's always around me. He's like a kid also. Alright guys, I guess I'm finishing up with my cat sniffing everything. He's like a dog. He has to sniff everything. 